What's going on, y'all? This your boy Ro from Bear Prince, and we're back at y'all with another video. Hey, today, we're going to be spicing it up. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Hey, but real quick, man, before I get to blabbing off at the mouth, bro, let me let my intro pop in, and I'm going to be right back with y'all. You feel me? All right, YouTube, man. Hey, I'm excited about this one today, man. You know what I'm saying? This one, hey, it's real fire right now, you know? And I feel like, you know what? Some people are into this, some people are not, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like, um, uh, you know, I, I look at it as like top notch, man. I see a lot of like um, high price, you know what I'm saying? Designers and things like this using this, you know? But look, guys, us right here, we got access to the same things that everybody else got too, you know? So today... Man, I'm going to be playing with some rhinestone transfers, you know. Um, these are bomb, guys, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, man, I know everybody's not into the rhinestone thing, you know. Some people ain't into the glittery, the whatever look, you know what I'm saying? And and that's for one reason why I, um, you know, sometimes I may not offer, and I, I feel like a lot of people don't always offer um, the sublimation on glitter shirts to guys sometimes, but it depends on the image because, you know, Hey, shout out my boy Mike Tease, you know what I'm saying? He be over there killing it with that sublimation on the glitter, man. And he be finding them dope images. So as fellas, can you feel me? Be shining out there, you know what I'm saying? But this, guys, I want to do something special today. I'm going to do rhinestone transfer on a jean jacket, guys. Today, we just going fully custom. It ain't no t-shirt. We doing the jean jacket today, man. I want to look fly out there, you know what I'm saying? I'm in California. I know it's the fall time, and a lot of you guys have lost the sun where you at, but it's still shining over here, you know what I'm saying? So when I go outside, man, you know, I want to make sure that I'm shining, whatever I'm doing. I want to make sure I'm representing myself. I want to make sure that people know what Bear Prince can bring to them, you know what I'm saying? So this is going to be one of the idols, man. I'm excited about this. This one, uh, my wife got a jean jacket that she has, and I'm going to put this on it, you know what I'm saying? We just thought it was a dope one, you know. Of course, she's not heartbroken, clearly. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? But uh, I think this is going to be dope. Um, we got a jean jacket over here. We got the heat press already up. This is going to be a quick video, y'all. You know what I'm saying? It ain't even going to be long. We we finna get to it. These, um, you know what I'm going to do? That's good. I, I like that. I never even realized they had instructions on here. And look, they give you instructions, guys, you know what I'm saying? You can get these, you can do them with the regular home iron, too. You don't have to have a heat press. If you don't have one, That that's perfectly fine, is what they're saying right here. Um, you can do it with a regular home iron, guys. It does request that these are at 330, and you press them for about 30 seconds. Um, my heat press was at about 300 because I just got done doing some puff vinyl, you know what I'm saying? Hey, if you don't follow me on TikTok or on Instagram or any of these other social medias, man, hey, go holla at your boy on one of these other social medias. I just did a dope video on TikTok, pressing some puff vinyl on a, a bleach shirt, you know what I'm saying? So, man, I appreciate y'all rocking with the kid, you know what I'm saying? Hey, and if you're not already... Click that subscribe button for your boy real quick, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm just out here trying to do my thing, man. Hey, this is another video, guy. I'm even closer, guys. I'm on the road to 500 subscribers, bro. Hey, that's crazy, bro. I promise y'all, I'm tripping right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm at like 460, 461 or something like that, man. It's an amazing feeling, man. I really, really, really appreciate all y'all really rocking with me. You know what I'm saying? So what I need to do is turn this heat press up. And then we're going to get to it, man. Turn my timer. And we're going to go by their settings because we really want this to be up in there. You know what I'm saying? We want to make sure that this transfer is in there properly the way it's supposed to be. Um, you don't want nothing falling off, nothing like that. I've used these transfers before um, on mask and even on a hoodie. I, I put like a small transfer on a hoodie, you know what I'm saying? And that was last year sometimes. I've, I've worn it numerous times, washed it. The, the rhinestones stay on there, guys. You know what I'm saying? I don't know as much about the rhinestones when you're kind of um, doing it yourself. Um, when they're not already made like this, you know, some people are cutting out the rhinestone templates with the cricket in the in the silhouette. And you know what? I'm going to do that real soon here, too, because I, I do kind of want to give that a try myself. Um, but in the meantime, in between time, I got this dope transfer already made, guys. And, um, you know, just real quick where I get these transfers from, them, hey, and we're doing a couple of them, guys. I was, I was almost going to make y'all wait, you feel me? But this one, 
Like I said, this one's for my wife. My wife has a dope jean jacket she found at the store, you know. Uh, man, you know, when, when you in the in the t-shirt game or in the customizing game, you know, when you're going out in the stores now, you're always looking for blank stuff, you feel me? So, um, we're going to put this one on hers, but, man, I found this super dope image, man. I got a jean jacket myself that I'm going to put this one on, and I think it's just going to be super dope, y'all. Look at this joker right here, man, like. This joint is so bomb right here, you know what I'm saying? Like, and you know, I, I ain't really about the gun violence or nothing like that, but I just really thought this was a super, super, super dope image. You know, I think people are really gonna like it, man. Um, and shoot, man, I'm finna go to a concert tonight, man. I'm finna wear this thing, man, and see if, you know what I'm saying? If we get a couple spectators, man, like, hey, where you get that at? Where, you, you know, and then that gives me the opportunity to say, oh, here's my card, you know what I'm saying? Hey, man, we promote everywhere that we go, but like I said, guys, um, you can most definitely put some things together. I I wouldn't know. I, I ain't seen nobody doing nothing this intricate, no two-color stuff or anything like this, doing the rhinestones themselves. We're cutting it through the cricket and cutting out the template and whatnot, um, but yo, Axie Land, Axie Land, guys, I'll put a link down there. I'm not affiliated or nothing, but it's a super dope store. If you're in um, LA, y'all can pull up on that thing, you know what I'm saying? Axie Land is in LA, you know? axi land um they got they specialize in rhinestone stuff you know what i'm saying um the only thing about stuff like this is this stuff is kind of in store only um they they really only have basic stuff on their website so the 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 thing is is like you know y'all can most definitely like screenshot this from this video right now and then be like hey i, I want to get this transfer right here but you kind of got to do stuff like this i i went up there in person and picked this up um but even for me i would have to go and um go send them a picture of this or i would have to go back there physically and go get this but if you're in the la area the fashion district area man axie land is a great place for rhinestone transfers um they got vinyl and stuff up in there too at a good price you know so yeah man so look guys we're gonna press them real quick my heat press is up this heat press is, is pretty quick you know it's pretty pretty good so it's, it's ready to go, guys. We ain't even finna. I'm gonna move y'all closer over here by the heat press, and we gonna get it going, guys. We gonna show y'all how to press a rhinestone transfer. That's what we doing here, guys. Now, guys, you do you do want to be careful with these, you know what I'm saying? I mean, they, they in there, and they stick to the to the top um, film piece right here, so you'll be peeling off this back piece, but just be careful because, you know, sometimes they may get out of place, you may mess one up, and it's, it's going to be really hard to get that back in place, guys, all right? So just keep that in mind. Be careful when you are um, taking off this back carrier sheet here. Just want to make sure I be careful because the carrier sheet is, is very sticky that the uh, rhinestones are on just to kind of hold them there in place good. Um, oh, I just felt myself touch one. Two. Okay, y'all. Yeah, we finna go ahead and lay this joker down. I want to make sure I get it in the right spot. I need to bring this the hood back up a little bit more real quick because I don't want the hood covering this at all guys so boom we got it keep the hood out the way all right guys 330 degrees for 30 seconds y'all All right, we got about 20 seconds left, y'all. Hey, I can't wait. This is going to be so dope. And I've pressed rhinestone stuff before, but I, I haven't done it on the jean material yet, y'all. So, man, this is a first. Y'all going to see a first, not last. You feel me? So, yeah. Yeah, 
right, guys. This is fire. I lost a little rhinestone, I see. I don't know if I can even place that joker back, yo. I'm gonna try though. I'll place it back where it's supposed to be. We're gonna try to hit a, you know, the second press ain't never hurt nobody.